Welcome to Career Day Training Solutions. Myself Mohan and this is session 2 on percentage. This video is about comparison between two quantities. We shall enter into an example. Assume there are two persons named A and B. A's income is rupees 1000 and B's income is rupees 500. Now listen to the question carefully. So B's income is how many percentage lesser comparing to A's income. So B is getting rupees 500 lesser comparing to A, right? So B is getting 500 rupees lesser comparing with A. So with, with whom we are comparing? We are comparing with respect to A, right? So A's income have to come in denominator. So you have to convert to percentage. So multiply this with 100. So if I multiply this with 100, I get zeros, zero cancel, zero, zero cancel. So 5 into 10, 50 percentage. So B's income is 50 percentage lesser comparing to A's income. Now the second question, A's income is how many percentage higher when comparing to B, right? So A's income is how many percentage higher when comparing to B. So I'm comparing A's income with respect to B. So A is getting 500 rupees higher when comparing to B. So here I'm comparing A with respect to B, right? So B's income have to come in denominator to convert to percentage multiply by 100. So 500 and 500 cancel, 500 and 500 cancel. So it is 100 percentage. So A's income is 100 percentage higher comparing to B and B's income is 50 percentage lesser comparing to A. I hope that you are getting this concept clearly, right? So if you understand this concept, we shall enter into the next example. So next example is Rahul's salary is 25% lesser than Sahul. Sahul's salary is how many percentage higher comparing to Rahul? For this type of questions, obviously we get option A, 25%, option B, 75% and option C, some other options, right? So if you don't know the concept, obviously we choose option A 25 percentage right but if you choose that answer then the answer goes wrong because now you know the concept right now we can solve this type of question using a short trick there are two persons Rahul and Sahul so Rahul salary is 25 percentage lesser comparing to Sahul right so if it is 25 percentage we know the equivalent fraction of 25 percentage it is 1 by 4 so Rahul salary is 25 percentage lesser comparing to Sahul. Sahul salary is how many percentage higher comparing to Rahul. Now this is the lesser fraction then obviously Sahul's fraction should be the higher fraction. So here you have to increase this fraction right. So if, if you want to increase the fraction then you have only two possibilities. Either you can increase the numerator or you can decrease the denominator. So you don't need to touch the numerator. You can keep the numerator as it is. Instead, to increase the fraction, decrease the denominator. So how much you have to decrease? So how much ever in numerator, you have to decrease the same. So in numerator, you have one, right? So decrease one from the denominator. So four minus one, you get three. Now, Rahul's salary is one by four lesser comparing to Sahul and Sahul's salary is one by three higher comparing to Rahul. To convert the fraction to percentage, multiply by 100. So 1 by 3 into 100, you get 33.33 percentage, right? So Rahul's salary is 25 percentage lesser than Sahul and Sahul's salary is 33.33 percentage higher comparing to Rahul, right? Now moving to next example. Kamal's mark is 25 percentage higher comparing to Rajni. Rajni's mark is how many percentage lesser comparing to Kamal? So it is similar type of question. But here it is given the increased fraction. Now you have to find the decreased fraction, right? So Kamal and Rajni. So Kamal's mark is 20 percentage higher, right? So Kamal's mark is 25, 20 percentage higher. So 20 percentage means we know the equivalent fraction 1 by 5. So this is increased fraction. Now you have to find the decreased fraction. Now to increase the fraction, you have to decrease the denominator. To decrease the fraction, you have to increase the denominator, right? Now, if it is 1 by 5 higher, then here you have to decrease the fraction. So you have to increase the denominator. So how much you have to increase? How much ever in numerator? So 5 plus 1, you get 6. To convert to percentage, multiply 1 by 6 with 100. So 1 by 6 into 100, you get 16 point 
66 percentage. So, Kamal's mark is 20 percentage higher comparing to Rajni and Rajni's mark is 16.66 percentage lesser comparing to Kamal. I hope that you are clear with this concept, right? Now, before winding up this session, please subscribe my channel, like the video, click the bell button to get instant notification and share this video to your friends and if you have any doubt, please pause it on the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.